we've traveled one kilometer. Five more ahead to begin climbing Mount Sharp. Some on Earth believe Mars could soon be a second home for humanity. But what the rovers are seeing looks like a ruined planet. Caustic dust and extreme cold challenge machinery, but could be deadly for biology. If you condensed all the water vapor in the Martian atmosphere, it would make an ocean only one millimeter deep. Curiosity's radiation detector started taking data as we left Earth orbit, sampling for 15 minutes out of every hour. How much and what kind of radiation would astronauts face? If you flew for six months to get to Mars, then explored the surface for 500 days, and took another six months to fly back to Earth, you'd absorb a greater than lifetime limit of radiation with at least a 5% increased risk of fatal cancer. On Mars, there's little atmosphere and almost no protective magnetic field. You'd be hit by solar energetic particles, some of which come at you at 80% the speed of light. Supernovas, pulsars, and other highly energetic events far away blast galactic cosmic rays. Spacesuits offer no protection. To avoid damage to your DNA, you'd have to live underground. It's easier, safer, and much less expensive to explore Mars from Earth through telepresence. But real people can't live in the virtual world. Colonizing Mars will be very risky.